now, your Central Coast forecast from KSBW Weather. Good evening, I'm Jonathan Bass in for Gina DeVecchio. We'll start with a look at our satellite imagery. Early this morning, we had a cold front sweep across the region that left behind clear skies, and that front is currently moving across Nevada and Utah, setting up a strong pressure gradient. And due to that difference in pressure, we've got a wind watch in effect through 4 a.m. Monday. It's not just our region, it actually extends across much of the western U.S. So we're looking at winds 15 to 35 miles an hour our gust to 40 right now 40 40 miles an hour in Big Sur, many 20 to 30 mile an hour winds elsewhere. And as you can see, those strong winds are extending across much of the western U.S. Highs today dominated by that cold air, mid to upper mid 50s to the low 60s, 61 in Prunedale, 60 in Gilroy and more upper 50s and low 60s in the Salinas Valley today, 60 in Greenfield, mid 50s to upper 50s around the Monterey Peninsula, 57 in Pebble Beach and 63 in Big Sur and Carmel Valley. Infrared satellite imagery over the Pacific shows a trough of cool air in place extending across much of California. And as we look at our future cast, here's that trough of cool air and that's remaining in place for tomorrow as well. So we'll have cold temperatures tomorrow and Tuesday, as we get into Wednesday, some warmer air starts to move in, but there's a little bit of lag time before we really start to feel the warm-up starting on Thursday. And we're talking a warm-up of about five degrees or so. So it won't ever get hot, but it will definitely warm up compared to what we're feeling now. Winds tonight out of the north will have some clouds move in briefly, but then they'll clear out. So we're looking at clear conditions, waking up tomorrow with winds offshore, then they turn northerly once again. We're looking at winds tomorrow about 10 to 20 miles per hour, so it'll be breezy, but they will be dying down. Frost advisory is in effect from Monday evening through Tuesday morning across the Salinas Valley and much of the Santa Lucia Mountains. And it's not that the air will necessarily be colder tomorrow night, but as those winds die down, that'll allow cold air to settle. 32 to 42 tonight, so we're looking at valley frost, Mostly clear tonight and breezy conditions tonight. Here are some of our lows. 33 forecast for Santa Cruz, 37 for Monterey, and 32 for King City. Forecast for tomorrow, 50 to 58. It'll be sunny but cold. Still winds 10 to 20 with gusts to 25. It'll be less breezy but still breezy. Everybody tomorrow right around the mid-50 range. Not a big temperature spread for tomorrow. KSBW 8-day forecast. Our coldest temperatures will be tomorrow and Tuesday. A little warmer Wednesday and that warm-up begins more in earnest. Thursday. Sunshine throughout the week and more cold air coming in next weekend. Overnight lows, coldest nights all the way through Tuesday night, and then we start to warm things back up. All frost danger is gone by the time we get to Thursday night. I like the sound of that. All frost danger is gone. That sounds good to me. Isn't that nice? Yeah. All right. All right. Thanks, Jonathan. Sure.